Yellowstone National Park is a national park located primarily in the U.S. state of Wyoming, although it also extends into Montana and Idaho. It was established in 1872 and is widely considered to be the world's first national park. Yellowstone National Park is known for its vast and diverse ecosystem, which includes dramatic landscapes, geothermal features such as geysers and hot springs, and a variety of wildlife, including grizzly bears, wolves, bison, elk, and moose. It's home to over 10,000 thermal features, including the famous Old Faithful Geyser, which erupts regularly and draws millions of visitors each year. Yellowstone National Park is also known for its important role in the history of national parks in the United States. Its creation marked a turning point in American conservation efforts, inspiring the establishment of other national parks and protected areas around the country. Something that it's not known for is mysterious glowing orbs. Interestingly, it's reported that a strange glowing object was detected on one of Yellowstone's live cameras, which caused people to upload the footage online in order to try and work out what it was. Oddly enough, these glowing objects have been reported across the entire United States, and some amateur researchers who've spent countless hours researching this phenomenon have said that they are one of the most commonly sighted mysterious aircrafts. As of right now, various theories have been put forward to try and explain what they are, but these sightings don't match everyday objects. Those who've seen the video have said that the glowing orbs appear to be moving throughout the area and can be seen pulsating. Others said that they spotted various objects throughout the video that don't look natural, with one person saying that a bright light can be seen flying into one of the geysers. This isn't the first time that strange objects have been seen above Yellowstone. Hikers have often detailed witnessing mysterious aircrafts above the national park, with one amateur researcher saying that these objects are actually quite common and that in many cases people don't realize that they've caught them. These glowing objects have been given various different names over the years, but the researcher said that they didn't realize how common they were until they started to slow down footage. Only then did they get an idea of how often these objects are captured. The interesting thing about these objects is that they don't fit into the conventional categories. In some cases that involve mysterious aircrafts, there's an argument that can be made that they are just top-secret aircrafts that the public don't know about, but with these glowing orbs, they are not big enough to be a plane or a helicopter. In most encounters, eyewitnesses describe them as being no larger than a few feet and having no discernible propulsion system. They are also noted as making no noise and being able to fly incredibly fast. It's for this reason that people have struggled to explain their sighting and has led them to look outside of the box. One theory that's been put forward is that these objects could be something like ball lightning. Ball lightning is a rare phenomenon that is typically described as a glowing sphere of light that appears during thunderstorms. It's often accompanied by a hissing or buzzing sound and can last for several seconds before disappearing. The exact nature of ball lightning is still not well understood, and there are a number of different theories about what causes it. Some scientists believe that it may be related to lightning strikes, while others suggest that it may be caused by the combustion of gases in the atmosphere. There have been numerous reports of ball lightning over the years, although it remains a relatively rare occurrence. Because it is so difficult to study and reproduce in laboratory conditions, much of what is known about ball lightning is based on anecdotal evidence and eyewitness accounts. Although ball lightning definitely matches the description of these objects, in many sightings there's no lighting present, and ball lightning is also not known to travel at extreme speeds. It's for this reason that researchers into the unknown have said that we're dealing with something entirely different, and that as of right now, 
we are no closer to understanding what they are and where they come from. Interestingly, some of the first sightings of these glowing objects were reported during the 1940s. The country where they are most commonly seen is that of the United States, but they've also been encountered above the United Kingdom, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, and various places in Europe. According to a large number of eyewitness sightings, there was an alarming number of consistent reports made of silent hovering objects that were described by onlookers and local residents as glowing aircrafts. The orbs were often detailed as appearing to be small aircrafts that demonstrated abilities impossible for known aircraft to have accomplished at the time. Detailed in the vast majority of witness reports, the glowing orbs were known for appearing out of nowhere, suddenly within the blink of an eye and disappearing just as quickly, vanishing into thin air or shooting off at incredibly violent speeds, impossible to replicate with any known technology at the time. Even airmen during the war would detail their encounters with them, describing glowing objects that would approach their aircraft as if inspecting it and then fly away at extreme speeds, with other sightings described as appearing to have the physical characteristics of ghostly light, with recounted stories emphasizing that the aircraft appeared to glow colors while demonstrating incredible violations of the basic laws of physics. According to the gathered data surrounding these glowing orbs, thousands of them have been reported. It's believed that throughout the early 2000s, over 3,000 reports were made by people throughout the United States, and those are just the ones we know about. That number is said to be much higher, as the majority of people don't report their encounters. The majority of these sightings were made during times that did not coincide with known meteor shower or lightning events, with them demonstrating abilities to maneuver, react, and change trajectories entirely. So, what do you make of these mysterious glowing orbs? Do you think they are just natural phenomenon, or are they something a little more mysterious? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.